The slow speed saw is the instrument used to cut samples for the various thermal and mechanical devices. The instrument consists of a variable speed motor blade and an oil bath. Be sure to wear proper personal protective equipment, including gloves and goggles and a lab coat. First, make sure the blade is mounted properly. The blade can be easily adjusted by removing the screw and securing the blade using the round plates on the right side of the instrument. The machine was found to best operate when the blade lettering is facing out. You can see the lettering on just one side of the blade. Then you can re-secure the blade by adding back the screw and the round plates. Next, make sure the oil is at the proper level. From the one gallon container, add the oil to a beaker and then add to the oil bath. The oil level can rise just above the bottom of the blade. This will help reduce friction and heat when the instrument is operating. Next we will mount the sample. The gate is controlled by two bolts and can be unscrewed using an Allen wrench. The sample size is limited by the lengths of these screws. Longer bolts can be obtained for larger samples. This sample cannot fit between the two screws. Therefore, sufficient pressure with one screw will be adequate in holding the sample. The samples are weighted down with these weights. These weights dictate the speed at which the arm falls or the speed at which the cut is made. Fewer weights used results in a slower cut. Softer materials should use fewer weights to create a uniform cut. The sample can be translated using the knob at the back of the machine. Each rotation is about one-third of a millimeter, or three turns will result in approximately a one millimeter translation. Once you reach the location of your first cut, you can set the material onto the blade. Typical speeds for cutting soft materials between 7 and 8, and 3 or 4 for a hard material. If the speed is too high for a hard material, the circuit breaker will pop and the machine will have to cool and reset. To start the cut, press the start button. First, the excess edge of the sample will be removed to create a straight edge for the successive cuts. During the cut, oil is lifted onto the blade of the sample. If your sample is not compatible with oil, a different instrument may need to be used. Softer materials take between 30 and 90 seconds. When the cut is almost completed, use a pair of tweezers to secure the cut piece. When the cut is complete, you can stop the machine using the red stop button. The cut piece can be removed and the knob can be used to translate the material for the next cut. Once the material is repositioned, another cut can be made. To remove the sample from the gate, use a pair of tweezers to hold the sample and unscrew the gate. After you are done using the machine, it must be cleaned as oil may have splattered during the cutting. This keeps the instrument in good condition and leaves it ready for the next user.